Welcome to Happy Learning Class. Hope you are doing great. Our topic for today is so interesting and I am super excited. The topic is Introduction to Industry. Do you know that an industry is best at the intersection of science and arts? I want you to ride along with me for more learning. Now let's look at um, understanding an industry. Now similar businesses are grouped into industries based on the primary products produced or sold. Um, this effectively creates industry groups which can then be used to isolate businesses from those who participated in different activities. Investors and economics often study industries to better understand the factors and the limitation of corporate um, profit growth. Companies operating in the same industry can also be compared to each other to evaluate the relative attractiveness of a company within that industry. So that is a little introduction or, uh, to and what industry now let's find out more about industry now let's look find out what is an industry the term industry referred to a group of companies that produce similar goods or service within a geographical area that is industry means a group of companies that produce similar goods or service within a geographical area. It can also refer to all the people and activities involved in making a particular product or providing a particular service. That is, it can refer to a group of people or activities that they do in making a particular product or providing a particular service. In summary, you can say an industry is a group of companies that are related based on the primary business activities. In other words, some industry produce physical goods such as chairs, plastic products or books, while others industry offer services like transportation, laundry or building. An industry could be owned by an individual, a group of people or the government. For example, the pizza industry is made up of all the producers who produce and sell pizza in the markets. A person cooking pizza at home for his or her children would not um, fit under this description as they are not selling any products or services. Now, um, the categories um, of industries in Nigeria. Now, in industries in Nigeria can be classified into two categories based on what they started and on the nature of the operation. That is what they produce. Now, the two categories we have in Nigeria are traditional industry and model industries. So these are the two categories of industry in Nigeria, traditional industries and the model industry. Let's learn more on them. Now it's time to look at um, the traditional industry. The traditional industry in Nigeria is referred to the form of industry that existed in Nigeria before the arrival of the Europeans and the colonization of Nigeria. I said it again, that the traditional industry is referred to the form of industry that existed in Nigeria before the arrival of the Europeans and the colonization of Nigeria. A traditional industry is an indigenous craft industry or handcraft types of industry practiced in pre-colonial Africa. Now, this kind of industry rely primarily on the mineral resources, animal and plants as the raw material for production. 
both men and women engage in these activities. Now it's time to check the examples of um, traditional industries in Nigeria. A number of these traditional industries still exist in different parts of Nigeria today. The first one we are looking at as an example of this industry um, include um, pottery, dyeing, carving, Then we have uh, more examples of a traditional industry in Nigeria, kennel building, salt making, mastery, and weaving. That's those that weave um, baskets, nets. And also, um, leather work, blacksmithing, basket making, are all examples of traditional industry in Nigeria. Don't forget them. Let me run them up. I mentioned pottery, dining, carving, kennel building, salt making, masonry, weaving, leather work, blacksmithing, and basket making. Now it's time to find out on the modern industry in Nigeria. Modern uh, industry, uh, industry that engage in mass productions of goods and services. Modern industries are what they are the industry that engage that are involved in mass productions of goods and services using machines and other modern equipments. So you can see the difference between the traditional and the modern one. Now, you know, the traditional one, we say that they have been doing them what before the existence of uh, colonial masters. So those are the um, way we are carving, basket weaving, this one. But the modern industry uh, industries in Nigeria, they are the ones that in, involve in what? Productions of goods and services, making use of machines and other modern equipment. Now, these types of industry were introduced into Nigeria by the British who colonized Nigeria. There are several examples of modern industry in Nigeria, which we are going to find out in our next slide. Now, um, it's time, let's look at um, examples of modern industry in Nigeria, uh, which include um, the textile industry, those that have to do with uh, clothes making and the um, um, fashion industry. That is the, for the textile uh, industry. We have banking industry that has to do with banking um, sectors. Film industry, this one also has to do with this uh, non wood, um, film marketers and film producer and so on. More on examples on the modern industry in Nigeria. Um, we have manufacturing um, industries and the uh, building industry. You know, manufacturing industry, they, they produce a lot of things, maybe baskets, board, um, bottles, and so on. Now, the building has to do with um, construction, building in properties, and so on. I'm sure by now you can dif differentiate between the traditional industry and the modern industry in Nigeria. Now it is time for us to look at the owners of the modern industry in Nigeria. You know, like I said earlier on, that uh, business uh, industries are owned by different uh, group of people. Like I, I mentioned the, the names that I said, the government, the private owner, and the uh, um, um, foreigner. Now, in Nigeria especially, is a, a rich endowed country with formidable natural, physical, and human resources. And the largest industry that gives the Nigeria, that boosts the Nigeria economic is what? Is the petroleum, tourism, agriculture, and the mining industry. These are the ones that boom up the economic of Nigeria. So now the industry or the owners of the modern industry in Nigeria fall into three categories. The first one is the government and the second one is private individual or groups of Nigeria 
and the last one which is the third one is the foreigners or non nigerian so we are going to study this um three groups of the ownerships of an industry in nigeria i said government private individual and the foreigner let's find out more on them government's um ownership many of the modern industry in nigeria are owned by the government this type of industries are called government-owned industries they can be owned by the federal the state and the local governments government-owned industries are called public industry i hope you understand that that any uh, industry that are owned by governments in nigeria is called government owned industry and it can be uh, owned by the federal the state or the local government and government owned industry are called public industry example we have the nita we have nigeria port authority and the federal road corporations of nigeria now it's um it's time to look at the private um individual or groups of nigeria these are uh, many um this kind of group we have many modern industry owned by private nigeria citizen the owner could be single individual a group of individuals or a non-governmental organization run by nigerians industry owned by nigerians are called private industries example we have oleron a uh, software channel networks management and consulting firms advertising agencies and the waste management companies now the final group in the owns of the modern industry in nigeria we have the foreigners or non-nigerians you know when we talk about the non-nigeria um is um some of modern industry in nigeria are owned by people who are not nigeria citizen so that's why we call it them or foreigners or non-nigerians um, ownership they are foreigners from other country and that is why these are called foreign industry example include we have the umba facebook emergence payments and the met water group all these are owned by a foreigner wow that is awesome hope you've learned a lot today remember an industry is the whole of all the economic activities by companies people and organizations involved in the production of goods and services for a particular field industry are usually categorized by the goods and services they produce since our next like our next class on the types of industry in nigeria keep learning bye